G'day, it's Brendan here, Mr. Cuddly Brick here out on a geocation adventure. I'm in some park, somewhere, geocaching. But anyway, uh, so I'm going to go for a multi-cache. I've done all the other spots. Uh, I've got um, the final dialed into the GPS. Um, and I am hopefully going to get it. So let's go a geocaching. Think that way. While I'm trundling along here, you can probably notice I've got a couple of little devices attached to me. So I've got my Spot Gen 3, and I've got my brand new, thanks for Santa, Tony Santa from Spot NZ gave me this Garmin InReach Explorer Plus. Amazing device. What's really cool about it is that it hooks up with your smartphone. Um, so you can use messaging on your smartphone where you've got absolutely no cell phone coverage. So if you're in the bush or in the mountains or trekking along or wherever like that and you want to get a hold of your partner or whatever just to say hey look I'm actually okay but I'm running a bit late. Um, you can actually do that off your smartphone, Bluetooth it into this little thing and send off a message. So I'm looking down because it rocks and all that kind of stuff. Um, so, you know, you can't really go wrong with it. It's also got a tracking feature, so your, your family or whoever you want to can actually track your movements. Um, so let's say you fall over, you donk your head, and you can't send off a message because you're unconscious, they know at least where to start looking because they can track you. So that's always a bonus. The other thing that's really cool with this is it does have an SOS feature to it. So you can push the button, and in a timely manner, if you're in the middle of nowhere, access is a real issue, a helicopter will come. Uh, well, that's probably the best way to do it, I guess. Or a search and rescue team. Uh, so, clicks up to those guys who are in search and rescue, they're volunteers. Um, so are a lot of the ambulance and fire services in the rural areas. Um, so, they help people who get themselves into trouble. But I guess the first thing is, is actually not to get in trouble so one of those things right I'm getting close to the GZ now <laughs> we'll uh, see how we get on You know, sometimes these little things are really hard to get. It was in the trees underneath a rock face with a massive gum tree that's fallen on it. Poor thing. Uh, it survived quite well, hasn't been found since March. It's now December, so. Woo! Bit of wind. Uh, found the cache, that's great. I'm going to mark I found the cache on my Gen 3, my Spot Gen 3 here. I'll send off a message using this as well saying, I found a geocache. This is Brendan out and about geocaching. <laughs> 